So it's me, your boy, K. Samson. I have this message for us. Guess what? Without a fuel, electricity, gas, uh, etc. Without these categories of things, no matter what flight in the air, like aeroplane, jet, helicopter, etc. Or car, machine, we have different what different what uh, bike now. So without this. The car can never move, no matter how beautiful the car may be or the aeroplane may be, it will never move. So you are the reason why they were moving before. <laughs> That's why Jesus said, the word of God said, he said, if the foundation is being destroyed, what can the righteous man, man do? In, in sense of, if Christ is no longer available in your life, what else will you do? If choosings are no longer available in your life, what do you think that you'll be able to do? So, the moment you left, that is when their car become what? Unmovable. <laughs> unmovable. It can't move. It's just there like a, what, like a mammoth. If you visit, if you have visited like uh, Italy, here in Milano, you will see a lot of mammoth. <laughs> like um, San Paolo. Mm, we, ha we have a lot of them. So, if you visit them, you will come to see that many of them have already been there like 20 years, 30 years, 50 years. They are still there. They don't move. This is how the life of your haters, frustrators <coughs> are. This is the, how the life of your enemy are. Because nothing is moving for them again. Yes, they were making it before. All is because of you. <laughs> because the fuel was available. They were doing well before. All is because the fuel is available. The fuel was inside the car. So no matter how beautiful your house may be, if you build a house, no matter how beautiful the house may be, before you park inside, you must surely do what? Clean the ground. You must surely make sure you clean everywhere so that it will not do what stain you. So you are the one that they need as badly as they wanted to live. But they messed up with you. That is the reason why things are no longer working the way it do used to. That is why things are not moving again. That is why everything that they touch turn to sorrow. Why? Because they messed up with someone whom God has sent into their life to move them. You are the reason why they were moving. You are the fuel that moved them. But the moment they messed up, that is when the fuel was taken. Listen, Jesus said to his disciples, any house you step in and they refuse to accept you, they refuse to treat you the way they ought to treat you, you should shake up your feet that it will be better than Sodom and Gomorrah than them on that day. So you are the reason why they were moving, succeeding, making exploit, becoming successful every day, doing something because all their prayer that have been praying, God have answered them by sending a helper like you into their life, by sending a choosing like you into their life. It can be your ex. <laughs> you know, sometimes when uh, when your ex or your fiancé, your your babe, your husband, when majority of them are are what are passing difficult time that is when they will see you your what your value but the moment they start to do well they will start to look for others thinking that those ones are what are more better than you that is the world we are living today the world we are living today is that when men are what are, are, are climbing they will do what they will love those who are who are within them they will keep them because they know that these ones are ready to do what to make sure work goes on. But once they start to succeed, all those ones who were with them, like their girlfriends, their boyfriends, who were always available in their life to assist them, to encourage them, to make sure they, 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 don't, they don't do what they don't quit, they will abandon them. They will tell them, you are not my type. You are not my type. They will just leave them, not knowing that that person is the real world foundation of your sources that's why sometimes the moment you leave your ex the moment you leave your husband the moment you leave your wife either by mistake or by incident you come to realize that things will start to turn apart like that of what nigeria fame so what am i trying to say many of them are regretting 
for letting you go. Many of them are regretting. Why? Because there is no more fuel to move them. There is no more benzene, according to Italy. There is no more benzene to move them. Everything is dry. Yes, the car is so handsome, but it cannot move without what without fuel. Yes, the electric car cannot move without you plugging it and charging it. So how can they move without you? It's impossible. That is why things are going up and down. That is why things are not working the way it ought to work. That is why things are no longer moving. Yes, <laughs> now they truly want you back. Now they are praying for you to come back into their life because mo many of them, majority of them have automatically figured out that you are the reason why they were moving before. You are the reason why they are progressing. That is the actual reason why they want you back. But it's too late because choosing, we don't go back to our vomit. No matter how, how hard life may be, we don't go back to our vomit. What we have vomited is what we have vomited. We don't eat our vomit. So many of them are regretting severely for letting you go. Remember blessed, you are the fool that have been moving them. And now it's no longer available. Remember blessed.